What's going on, guys? My name is Sputnik. I'm Andy. And today, we're watching some more Gravity Falls. But this time, we're watching the shorts. Indeed. These came out in between season one and season two. I know there was a little bit of gap um, in between those se seasons coming out. But uh, here we are with the shorts. I think they're each like two to three minutes long, yeah. something like that. And I, I have no idea what to expect here. I guess we'll be vi little vignettes telling us stuff about what goes on in Gravity Falls. Like, I'm saying, does it, like, occur? Like, do they take place in between, or are they just... That'd be my guess. I guess they were just to tide people over. Let us know if they, like, maybe came out online or something like that. Or maybe... I mean, like, yeah, channel. like, just, yeah, like, do the the setting of the... Yeah, sorry. I'm meaning, like, mm -hmm. they actually, like, take place... I believe that. I okay, would assume sorry, so. That's what I, okay, I was making yeah, sure that... Yeah, it's just to hold people over until season two came out. But, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but, yeah, I'm saying, I, I assume they probably, what, like, showed in between, you know other stuff on Disney because Disney's not too guess. like you know yeah. yeah they don't show like real commercials only yeah 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 you know so I could see that I could definitely see that mm -hmm. um yeah there's seven or eight I believe so that'll be fun to run through these and I must say I have uh after finishing the first season I fully gained appreciation for the show I really love the art style I don't know if we talked about it much but I do love just the lighting of all of it and just the kind of nature the way the nature is depicted in the show it's, mm -hmm. it's it's pretty damn beautiful i don't know why it never really called to me before but now having seen the show giving it a chance i love it hmm. Hmm. yeah uh before we start y'all don't forget to like comment and subscribe try to hit our goal of 9k subscribers before the end of july that'd be nice um so help us out with that if you keep coming back every week we're rolling into season two after this um and if you become a patron like these fantastic people listed here, the Patreon satellite subscribers, you can watch our first ep our reaction to the first episode of season one right now over on the Patreon. It's live over there. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to check these shorts out. I don't really have much expectations, but if it's yeah, like if it's follows, not too it's much to fun. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I guess we'll just hop in and check them out. Let's do it. Let's go. All right, our first one is entitled. Candy Monster. Let's go. Well, that concludes Gravity Falls Anomaly number 13, the Mobius Chicken Strip. <laughs> it's infinitely delicious. Yeah. Nice. Whoa, hey, what the... What the... Mabel, did you see that? Wake up. Never. Let me sleep forever. <laughs> Some... She's letting him sleep. Mm -hmm. She's sleeping with the lights on? That's crazy. When what? you constantly have someone what? who keeps the lights on, you get used to it. Ew. Ew. Naked little man. What the hell? Okay, this is now Dipper's Guide it to the Unexplained, number 76, uh, that thing. No, what the down. hell? Put it down. Oh, gross! <laughs> okay, I'm ready. I'm got a little grossed out, too. Mm hmm. I'm gonna yes. capture him for science. And for candy! Get this on tape in case I die or whatever. <laughs> okay! Alright, Dips. <laughs> Put some candy in the bin and hold you up on there. Oh. Not his butt. Oh, die, die. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I love this 3D mm, the uh, style. Uh -huh. It's almost like a video game. First person. Have you seen it? Oh my god. Ew. Girl, she walked past her. Like... Oh, no. Why is it hairy? Like, just. Just hairy, hairy enough, enough to, to be. be yeah. To... <laughs> what? No. Why would I. I'm... Actually, that's pretty good. Yeah. It's just Mabel, please. Look, he's hypnotized by the TV. <laughs> Not a bad candy. Up, is it? What a little dummy. Clued to the. To the. I'm trying to figure out what they're what looking this? at. We're looking at a GIF. Shouldn't we do something about the monster? Candy now. Not of eating the golf clubs, dear lord. He'll just eat anything. The candy's just especially good. Oh, hi, Jumper. Hey, Mabel. Hi, Grunkle Stan. Well, <laughs> got he's him. like, it's gotta be. <laughs> the next episode will probably be about getting rid of this candy eating monster. Okay. Psst, Stan, what's he talking about? <laughs> Oh, oh. I've got a little. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Um, but yeah, that was. So, do you think they're all gonna be like that? Um, from Dipper's perspective. Not necessarily. I just. If that was the first one. That, I don't know. I don't think they're all gonna be from. I mean, he is the main character, so maybe. But 
I figure everyone will, I mean, the next one, I know what the title is, so it might be from someone else's perspective. Yeah, first guy to the next one. Well, I loved that uh, found footage <laughs> style behind it. <laughs> I feel like these were just ideas that they had that weren't good enough to, or not, not weren't good enough, but uh, they couldn't just really flesh out it. to be fully, uh, um, you know, the full 10, 22 minutes, excuse me. Um, but yeah, I liked that one. It was <laughs> the power of TV <laughs> rotting your brain. All right, this next one is called Stan's Tattoo. And I remember, I, 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 I don't remember what episode I saw, but I pointed out that he has a back tattoo, I believe. Right? He muted it. Sorry. But I don't remember. Yeah, it was Stan has a back episode. tattoo, I believe. This is Stan's <clears throat> Tattoo. Let's go. Hello, I'm Dr. Pines. A girl trying to crush my head is Mabel. I'm helping. Today on the <laughs> Guide to the Unexplained. Okay, that that's enough. Today we investigate anomaly number 23, Grunkle mm -hmm. Stan's secret tattoo. Mm -hmm. so what is he it. hiding? A college prank? Secret symbol? Or something stranger? Stan claims it doesn't exist. But today oh. we're gonna find out. You might have been What's under Mabel's bandage? <laughs> Gross. Okay, here's the plan. Stan never takes off his undershirt, obviously to hide his tattoo. But me and Seuss are about to turn up the heat on this mystery. <laughs> Literally. Oh, oh fuck Christ. Up with stuff There's like no that. way. Whew. Hot in here today, huh, Mr. Pines? Probably be a lot cooler if we worked without our shirts on. <laughs> Am I right? Seuss, I will pay you to put your shirt back on. Damn. Oh, don't be shy, Mr. Pines. <laughs> <laughs> Bodies are nothing to be ashamed of. He's Walk right. Shop for okay. a minute, Zeus. I need to go find a melon baller and pull my eyeballs out. <laughs> Damn. He looks fine. Do 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 do. Hey. Do 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 do. Okay. Plan B. Heavens, is that poison oak on your shoulder? Let me scratch it for you. Kid, if you're trying to see my tattoo, you're gonna have to try harder than that. Mm -hmm. Aha! I thought you said you didn't have a tattoo. Oh. I don't. But you do. What do you mean I <laughs> But you do. <laughs> okay, please. Stan is in the shower. I wish it hadn't come to this, but sometimes you have to do terrible things for science. I believe in you, Google. The way his eyebrow went, like, oh, through the... <laughs> mm. You're never gonna see it, kid. <laughs> You're never gonna see it. How long That's have you been standing insane. there? Give me that camera. <laughs> He's been so in there I with the suit I'd on. Chill out on the roof for a while. I'm gonna find you, kid. <laughs> well, that's it for this episode. Stan's tattoo remains a mystery, but who knows what other. I mean, you can see that he has an arrow. Part of it. That's <laughs> enough, Zeus. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Why is his eyes dumb? All like tiny like that. The people okay, are tiny, second, but his second. eyes are big. One, two, three, five. Next. Um, let's see. No, and then he. Hmm. I was looking at this cyber. <laughs> I just want to see that a good frame for... of his. Uh, I mean, we don't. Um, maybe it's a birthmark and not a tattoo. He kept saying it's not a tattoo. Maybe I don't know why it'd be like colored a, differently, right. <laughs> but it could be a birthmark. Um, can we see it? Yeah, we see a little arrow, a circle, and a little. Ooh. It looks like a. It could be a bird or a W, depending yeah, on how w. realistic this is supposed to be, considering it's a cartoon. <laughs> yeah. Well, eventually we'll see that, hopefully. Wait, go to the end. Yeah. All right. Short three is entitled The Mailbox. Welcome back to Dipper's Guide to the Unexplained. Anomaly number 54, The Mailbox. There it is, in the middle of the forest. No house, no address. Today, hmm. me and my team of expert... Stop. Are <laughs> team of experts. ...see who picks it up. My letter posits a salient question. Sup, dog? Hmm. <laughs> You gotta put a pen now in there so they can respond. A bush and wait for someone to come oh, by. Dude! What the? Oh, that's insane. Did you see that? It's giving me Monster Open House it. vibes. Don't mm -hmm. you open it, dude. I'm not touching a ghost mailbox. Okay, okay. <laughs> Here it goes. Not much, dude. Whoa, that's a whole letter. letter. Dude. It says... It's got an infinity symbol. Hello, Dipper and Seuss. It knows our names. What if this thing's all knowing? We gotta test it. What did I shave into my head this morning? Hmm. A baby duck holding a paddle ball. Dude, it knew. 
What the hell? Ask it more questions. When is the end of the world? Three thousand twelve. Huh? We got a while. Oh, hot tamales. Save that one for the archives. Okay. What is the exact time and date of my death? The aliens built the pyramids. What is the meaning of life? Marshmallow trade-offs. Who wrote journal number three? Who wrote the journal? Who wrote the journal? We're finally gonna get the answer to the greatest mystery of gravity falls. Maybe a mailbox. I've been wanting to mail mom this video of me sticking a hundred gummy worms up my nose. No, wait. Girl. Never send me anything um, again. Your gummy worm video has disturbed and insulted me. Yeah. You fools are unworthy of my great knowledge. The mm -hmm. era of human enlightenment shall never come to pass. Wow. What the hell? Well. Well, uh, that concludes Jeez. Dipper's Guide to the Unexplained, where we learned when dealing with the unknown, do not mail videos of you shoving gummy worms up your nose. There's more where that came from. And to my nose. And to no, my no, nose. Show over. Show over. Oh my god. Mabel, please. Don't. Yeesh. That was probably my favorite one thus far. That's such a cool concept. And of course. Oh my god. <laughs> Them teasing us with knowing who uh, made the. Um, the different Journal. journals or whatever. It's gotta be something related to Uncle Stan. Grunkle. Grunkle Stan. Uh, I don't know. He knows about them, obviously. So there's some one of his friends or something like that, or whoever made the. I doubt his his father knew about all this stuff. To his such a hard ass, but they did show him us. Show us him. <laughs> Oh, um, what'd you think of it? Yeah, it's good. Mm -hmm. Maple, stop shoving things up your nose. Challenge failed again. Indeed. She's been more of a side character <laughs> for these. I guess it's a Dipper project. He's just. Uh... I mean, it is. It's literally. You're right. Like you said, it's uh, Dippers. Yep. Yeah. Dippers little mini show. All right. Let's keep it going. All right. This one is episode four. Lefty. All right, uh, welcome back to Dipper's Guide to the Unexplained. Today we investigate Gravity Falls Anomaly number 82. This guy. Hmm. Sure, he looks normal, but if he's so normal, explain why he's always facing left. Ooh. Literally, I've been following him around for weeks. And I've never this once seen side. the right side of his face. <laughs> and neither has anyone else. But why? <laughs> Mabel, theories? Theory Maybe he's always following he's with the camera. embarrassing sunburn. Theory two, half man, half lizard man. Okay. And theory number three, my personal favorite, he's normal and okay. Dipper's just crazy. That's a theory. That doesn't count as a theory. Yeah. <laughs> we find out now. Hello, good sir. Uh, I'm sorry, cameras aren't allowed in here. Oh, oh it's not on, not on. He bought it. <laughs> so, <laughs> sir. Would you mind grabbing those bowling shoes for me? The ones on your right side? Those ones? Whoops. Oh no, I dropped my wallet. <clears throat> it's over to your right there, your right side. Could maybe turn around and. <sighs> there you are, sir. This episode only exists in like cartoon logic. <laughs> you can, see him you can literally on. see him, exactly. Well, uh, I was thinking it could be the. Uh... Whoa! What the hell? <gasps> Jesus Christ. <gasps> We're blown! Shut it down! Shut, Shut it down! Shut it down! Time is gone! Time is gone! Time Whoa! Is gone, I can't! I have a family! You saw They're just you. killing themselves? Oh my god! Ah, oh, come on! Sprinklers are on! Well, that concludes anomaly number 82. What? Uh, I think we might want to burn this tape. Oh my well, god. That was insane, bro. <laughs> this show gets dark, bro. Not them all committing a mass cyanide. That was insane. What the hell? That's not a very uh, good design, to be honest. <laughs> if half of you was exposed at all time. The men in black uh, aliens knew how to do it right, at least. Okay. Like you said, it's just cartoon logic. <laughs> I loved that though. That <laughs> I think it's funny that that will never be explained. But Jesus, that was 
surprisingly dark, I must say. I'm just towards the end there, honestly. <laughs> oh, man. Dipper, you doomed all those little alien guys. That one was very short. Just straight up two minutes. They all have been about that, right? Yep. All right, this episode is called Tooth, episode five. The Tooth. Welcome to Dipper's Guide to the Unexplained. Anomaly number 42, the tooth. Okay. I'm Ooh, Rupert Gale. I found it yesterday tooth. when I was uh, practicing. Hey, is that a giant tooth? Strangely human, but it's gigantic. It's bigger mm. than any fish or lake monster I've ever seen. And we're going to find out where it came from. Tooth? No, don't know nothing about a tooth. We were thinking of paddling out on that lake tonight. Bit of friendly advice, boy. You see bubbles on that lake, run. What? Why? Enough questions. Get that camera out of here. The whole lake is a mouth. Uh, maybe. I'm here at the lake to investigate. I brought Mabel for backup. And I brought Barrow, my adorable childhood puppet. hi oh my friend. god. Did it's somebody horrifying. say honey? Looks like that bear from Chuck E. <laughs> no, Cheese, creepy. right? Barrow's creepy. No, Everyone bit. hates Barrow. But Gipper, who could hate Barrow? I can think of a few people. They're quite a pair, Mabel and Barrow, her unbelievable bear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was so bad. Oh, no. Uh, come on, you'll see. You, me, and Barrow are the adventure team of a lifetime. Spending a lot of time on Barrow. <laughs> Something <laughs> out there left, left that tooth, and we're going to find out what it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What are we supposed to be looking for? I don't know. Just look out for bubbles in the water. Dipper, look! They're over by that island. We have to see what happens. What is that? Ah! Oh no. What's happening? It doesn't matter! Row, row, row! Ooh, that's way scarier than... Oh. Sentient island. It's getting closer! Keep rowing! No. I don't know. I've been looking for... There it is. Okay, oh after it attacked us, that giant head thing just sunk back into the lake, and it lost another one of its teeth trying to eat our boat. Yeesh. But the important thing is, we survived. Barely. Uh, yeah. Barely. Barely. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> Bro, this, this, is, this is giving a Blair Wish Project. Just all the I mean, it's just like the typical found, found footage. footage. Mm -hmm. The OG found footage. It. Oh my god, that was actually... I expected that. I, I was, yeah. I guess a mouth the size of the whole lake would be way too big for the size of the world. But still, a sentient, floating uh, island. This is pretty cool. But yeah, no, I, I liked that one. The tooth. Now it's the teeth, considering we got two of them. All right. This episode is called "The Hide Behind." Episode six. We're on! Oh, <clears throat> hello, and welcome back to Dipper's Guide to the Unexplained. <laughs> oh, thank you. Today, we investigate Gravity Falls Anomaly number 132, the hide behind. Local lumberjacks tell of a mysterious creature always Ooh, just Slenderman. out of sight. Mm. But these photos suggest it might actually be real. Either way, I intend to find out. Ah, ah, hide behind! behind. <laughs> hide behind? Mm. Oh, he's real, all right. Real as my beard! Was behind me once. Made this sound. Mighty spooky. He's coming down! <laughs> Dad, he's doing a movie! He's doing a movie now. Could I get a refill, ma'am? Refill? Oh, the hide behind is definitely real. Might even be behind me right now. Let me see. Whoa, whoa, Girl, stop spilling whoa, the coffee. Whoa. <laughs> Don't believe every legend you hear, kid. The Mediocre people in this town are literally the dumbest Where's people the in the world. Team? Literally. Wow! It's wow! Wow! It shows from like the here. Hide behind's just a rumor. You want a mystery? Well, how about the mystery of I? What the? Ah! That's it. Hey, we're doing it. Oh, I saw his arm or something. Dead. I'm coming for you. Where is he? Where is he? All right. After hours of searching, I've narrowed it down to this just tree. Tape a camera to your back. I know what you're wondering. How do you catch a creature who's always right behind you? How about a mirror suit? Okay. Nothing's gonna sneak up on old Dipper. Ah, ah! I'm oh down. God, Dipper Mabel. down. This is it. Get ready to finally be seen. Hide behind. In three, two, 
One. Aha! What? <laughs> oh, cool! Maraca owl! That is pretty cool. Well, based on the lack of evidence, I have to conclude anomaly number 132, the hide behind, just a legend. One of the. Ooh. Mm. Uh. It's an it's Enderman! It's like the Enderman! I was literally gonna say. <laughs> eh, nothing. I'm sorry, that's giving Luffy if y'all have ever seen that episode of One Piece. <laughs> that was, that cool. was cute. Okay. I like him hiding. Uh, I don't know. It's like, you know, one of those, not even an urban legend. It's just like, what if whatever's following me is hiding as soon as I turn around to see it? Right. You know? Like, you, ne you never really know because if yeah. it is doing that. <laughs> Silly. The design was, was kind of creepy too. I liked it. I kind of liked it. Yeah, I know. It was pretty cool. Nice. All right. And I guess we're on to the last one. That's it. Oh, there's one more. My turn. Yeah. All right, we have one last one. It's called Heist Movie in the Petting Zoo. Is um, it a little bit longer? No, it's just two minutes, but oh, okay. it's episode seven. So let's see um, what it has to offer. Wow, we had a lot of good memories this summer. Yeah, Whether it was battling gnomes, solving mysteries, oh, the cow. or winning that dog sled race against that I did, we did not see you. Sure. Forget that trip to the petting zoo. No. I'm gonna pet you. This one is I'm more like a pet you. Oh, you better believe I'm gonna pet you. Uh, more um, limbs means more hugs. Whoa! I didn't think nature would allow this. Why does he look yeah, like a Vin Heck farmer? What gives? Funny. Octavia? Well, she's just another from the doesn't toxic mean. sludge running off the mud flat factory. Sure. Oh my god, what are the Simpsons? Oh my god. <laughs> I could pet this cow forever. Well, get your petting done now, because I'm going to eat her come cow eating season. <gasps> what? So you want to eat the freak eat? to gain its mutant power? Yeah, that's not necessarily the type of meat that Uncle I would prefer Stan, to eat if that's the case. We can't let Octavia be eaten. Come on, Mabel. Cows are delicious. But we love her. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> <laughs> Warm up the truck. <laughs> Howdy. Hi, I'm calling for pictures of tractors monthly. Please hold for an important message. Da 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 you gotta kill that damn. I'm saying, yeah. girl. Serves me right for building an escape ramp. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't question that at all. Here's a little something to remember us by. She was all right for a mutant. Whoa. I mean, she liked uh, them. Right. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, oh fun. my god. <laughs> they let a Homelander cow out. Well, thank, thank, nah, for real. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> thank you, Mabel. That little fish. Well. Cute. What the fuck? <laughs> so Mabel's, we got Mabel's scrapbook as a little thing. I would it'd be cool if we got like a series of her little stories too. We got a bunch of dippers and only one of hers, but I liked it. That was. <laughs> That's very on mutant brand. Cow. Yeah, mutant cow. Sure, of course. I like that we got Grunkles. And this was like a just a super sped up episode, honestly. I could see them doing like a whole episode like this. With Octavia. Um, yeah, Octavia and maybe more Ooh, animals. Well, I guess well. it's not the first time. I mean basically Waddles them going back and trying to rescue Waddles is yeah. kind of the long Except form it's version freeing this time. Yeah. Oh, and she did free M Romando, so that's kinda of fun. Oh true, beats. true. Like yeah, that is low key that's very on yeah. brand for her, I guess. That's that's one of the things she does. And she freed the boys. Mm -hmm. She likes to free <laughs> yes. Wait a minute. Except she was the main option on that. I one. know, but still at the end of the day, yeah. she 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 likes to free things. Alright. Well, I guess it's time to actually roll into the next season, yeah. Alright, and those were the good shorts. Which one was your favorite? Um I really liked the lefty. I don't know, I just didn't expect it to be that uh morbid at the end. But the hide behind was nice as well. I liked the hide behind. Yeah. And I like the tooth. 
mostly because it was still really scary. Yeah. And good. nothing like scary. got resolved in any way, scary. shape, or form. <laughs> Very good. Uh, mailbox, I like the idea. Of, it's like Twilight Zone. I did like, like the mailbox is very Twilight Zone. Twilight coded. Zone, uh, yeah, definitely. Sand tattoos just seems like it's. Um, that I mean, preparing that's it. like very much just like how kids are though. Like you know, wanting to noticing around. something like that on an adult being like, <gasps> but like, like you know, your teacher or, or something. It is definitely suspicious. <laughs> I mean, I could see like like an elementary school teacher, you know, someone like that. Like you see them, they're like, what's that? And you're like, oh no, nothing. Like you know, <laughs> I could I could see that being a thing. It's kind of cute. That's yeah. how kids. Uh, Honestly, I guess horrible. the candy monster was the least. <laughs> He was just uh, a scary, was, hairy, yeah, little, <laughs> <that> <laughs> stuff, little like, goblin. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, well, maybe he'll come back and eat you. So watch your mouth. Oh, excuse me. Um. Well, y'all, thank you so much for watching the Gravity Falls shorts with us. Um. Thank you, um, Waddles for being here. Was Waddles was not in any even of them. He in there? Any of them. Well, he was here with us this whole time. Um. I bet you didn't realize he was here with them. Yeah. Um. This was silly. I could see them doing a whole, I don't know, like a whole mini-series of these or whatever. But I mean, seven is a good enough. That's a good amount. I, yeah, I mean, it, that basically works out to about a full episode. About an episode, yeah. So they probably just use the budget for like one extra episode to make these, yeah. which is nice. Uh, and now, I guess there's nothing left for us to go into the next season of Gravity Falls, y'all. Um, so I guess we'll see you next week when we get into season two i'm so excited to get into like the more um plot heavy you know part of the show who knows maybe we'll make some good predictions like that. all right yeah thanks for watching what's next take a moment remind yourself take a moment and find yourself take a moment and ask yourself this is how we fall apart but it's not it's not it's not so gay. Please. <laughs>